it's really hard to put into words, but uh, the satisfaction of building something that is functional and does a task that you designed it to do is, is immense. I really wasn't sure what kind of engineering I wanted to be when I came in. Mechanical encompasses everything. You're taking classes that civil engineers are taking, electrical engineering, biomedical. There's overlap with everything. I want to be kind of on the leading edge. I want to be working on what's next. One of the ways I want to do that is I want to work in the racing industry somewhere. I participate in the uh, parks racing team. I don't think I would have been able to take the leadership that I've been able to take in my first two years unless it had been a small university. So our little bit smaller size means they're going to get a lot of hands-on experience and they're going to get much more direct access to faculty than you'd get at many programs. Most of us engineers can't just sit in a classroom all day. We want to actually see how the stuff works. SLU really caters to the hands-on experience environment. You know, I gotta work on robots, I gotta do programmable logic controllers, PLCs. Now that I've like used a lot of this stuff, I don't feel so overwhelmed when I go looking for jobs and I can tell people, yes, I've learned how to use this equipment. It's really been beneficial to me that I can go to a company and say, hey, I've used this ANSYS simulation software. And they go, wow, we typically don't get people who can do that who are like, you know, juniors or seniors. You can get into other industries. You can take other classes and be able to understand another component of this complex world. You can really do whatever you want with mechanical.